Hey, what's up guys? Quick video. This is a bit of an Xbox One X rant. Those of you that know me, I'm Brian, Whisper Status Channel. I don't do many rant videos, but this one occurred to me the other day when some buddies of mine and I picked up Modern Warfare Remaster for the Xbox One. We hadn't played online games in a while, but we wanted to go back to a game that was familiar. I knew this game looked good on the PS4 Pro, even though it hadn't been patched on the Pro. So what led me to this video, other than this little side story, is one of the subscribers to the channel hit me up with a question. His name is Eli Ellis, and he has a Sony 930E. He is a PS4 Pro fan, and he decided to buy an Xbox One X to enjoy the best visuals he can on third-party titles. He figured he'd get the most powerful console, judging by all of the marketing that we all know that I love so much. Um, most powerful console ever made, close to PC power. Um, he's seeing all of that and he takes the plunge. He buys a console and fires up Battlefield and I believe the other one was Rainbow Six. And it looks hard and he has no idea why. He hits me up in a comment and the questions. Right away I go to the usual suspects, you know, are is your HDMI enhanced? HDMI cables, um, what's the settings in your Xbox One uh, profile, what are the settings there, is all the Xbox 4K settings checked, are they all green? So, then I thought back to just a few days ago, picking up Modern Warfare Remaster on Xbox One, and realizing how horrid it looks. Now, this is on the PS4 Pro, this game was not patched, it looks decent, it doesn't look great, but if I was to then pick this up on the Xbox One X, this is really what you would be seeing, and it's terrible. That's the Xbox One X version. Now, the camera doesn't quite pick up how bad it looks. The aliasing is terrible. It's fuzzy. So, this looks actually worse than a 360 title, and this isn't... A backwards compatible title. This is a remaster that was done for the Xbox One. It wasn't patched though. But the funny thing is either was the PS Pro port, uh, PS4 Pro version. So that's what's making Eli so freaked out. He thought his Xbox One X was broken. The reason why I don't show you Battlefield is I don't have Battlefield 4 version of PlayStation uh, 4 version anymore. But this is easier because it is a like-for-like. Like. Neither one of these games have been patched, just like the Battlefield 4 title wasn't patched either. But the muddiness of this game is similar to the Battlefield 4 version versus the PS4 Pro Battlefield 4 version. So if I go back to the PS4 version... Now these are on the same HDMI, by the way. I'm using a Switch. Same game settings, the cleanliness, and this game, and this, I'm picking a hard map simply because of the grass and the foliage. The aliasing is very hard on this type of image. If you look at the grass and everything, it just you'll see jaggies everywhere. But the muddiness of the Xbox version, even though it's on the Xbox One X, is inexcusable. So if you're picking this game up, or you're picking up an Xbox One X, you're like, wait, th what the hell happened? I'm expecting, you know, the best game, the best looking, the most powerful, and it looks like hell. What's funny is the camera makes it look decent, actually, but I'm telling you, take my word for it, if you have both these games, try it. It's not even close. It's muddy, it just looks terrible. So, where does the rant come in? Well, the rant comes in where Xbox One X has done a terrific job of backwards compatibility. Meaning going back to titles, whether it's The Witcher 3, which looks unbelievable. Titles like Red Dead, Resident Evil. Going back to these games and you're realizing, wow, it looks unbelievable. It looks like a PC game. To the point to where my 4K PC was down and I had no problem picking up Far Cry 5 on the Xbox One X. I had no problem picking up Dishonored 2 on the Xbox One X. So they've patched these games, but other games they've just not patched. Battlefield 1 is the worst of all, because it's a very popular game that people are playing now. But games like this, that you're popping into your Xbox One X and you're expecting an up conversion to at least 1080p, I'm telling you, you're looking at 720p at best. Now, that would be fine 
if this was, for instance, Modern Warfare on the 360. But it's just awful. And I think it's leading people to believe that they're, like Eli, that his Xbox One X is having problems. Because Battlefield 4 looks great on his PS4 Pro, even though it's not, um, even though it's not patched, he has no idea why his Xbox One X looks this much worse. And, you know, it's just something that shouldn't happen. When you have a PC and you're going back to old games with new hardware, for instance, one of my favorite games is Spec Ops The Line, right? It's a 360 game. Go back to it, fire it up, the game looks amazing. Now this is Spec Ops The Line on PC, running at 4K. This game is extremely old, and look at it. It's a very fun game, I suggest you pick it up, you can grab it for like 50 cents. But this is basically a 360 title that is, on, is in 4K on PC. Now to say it's not fair to compare this to backwards compatibility or non-patched games is not exactly fair. Obviously if you have PC, you get a new CPU, you get a new GPU, you pop it in, you go back to your old titles and you're like, wow, now that I have this new GPU, CPU, whatever I have, I can go back to the titles that I love and look how amazing they look. I mean, this game could pass for a new title, honestly. The lighting, the way it looks, I mean, really, amazing how clean it is. But you get an Xbox One X or even a PS4 Pro, let's just say PS4 Pro, you pick up a game like Bloodborne that you missed. I'm expecting that game to look a little bit better than it did on PS4. That's why I bought a Pro. And it's just not the case. So going back to, you know, our other video, or my other game. With my brand new Xbox One X, I'm expecting a title that's made for the Xbox One to look at least passable. At least not 360. Now granted, when a game comes out for Xbox One X, if you do purchase it, anything new is going to look better on it. Um, a lot of games they've patched, Gears of War... Uh, Red Dead, they look phenomenal. They act just like that PC game I just showed you, Spec Ops The Line. But to play a game on PS4 Pro that's not patched, and then to come back to a game on Xbox One X that's not patched, and to see it look the way it looks, is making a lot of people scratch their head and wonder, why in the hell did I pick up this system? And that's where I think both systems can really get better, guys. Not just the Xbox One X, but the PS4 Pro. But the marketing basically saying, hey, you buy this machine, the up conversion to 1080p, guys, that that is 720p at best. And that's a new game. This remaster is not a backwards compatible version of the 360 remaster. They redid this game. And like I said, it's passable on the PS4 Pro. I would play this, but I found the other title to be unplayable. To the point to where playing Black Ops 2 on backwards compatibility looked better than the remaster. So, I, I at least expect this to a degree, and I know the reason why. But for those of you that have a PS4 and are looking to the Xbox One X, just know, look at the backwards compatible list of games. You can see it online, and then make your purchases there. But just know, like all up conversion, none of it is going to be magic. You're not going to all of a sudden just turn around, pop in any game, and say, Wow, why the hell isn't Battlefield looking great? Now, also, Battlefield has HDR, which I think confuses people, because all of a sudden they're like, wait a minute, it has HDR, why does it look this way? They just haven't patched it. Now, that's up to the individual developers, guys. Uh, Microsoft can only do what they can do. I don't know why DICE has not done that, or why COD. I don't know what the reasoning is, but if you have a PS4 Pro, and you picked, or you just picked up an Xbox One X, and you wonder why... On your brand new, huge, beautiful 4K TV, the games look like this. It's simply because they haven't been patched. And just know that games aren't just going to automatically upconvert. I don't care how powerful the system is. So that's my rant, guys. Um, I expect more from both systems. Um, to compare them to a $2,000 PC is not fair. But I showed you a video of a game that is old as hell. And it looks better than almost anything on this game, on this system right now, as far as anything a little bit older. And for Eli Ellis, it's not your imagination. This is just the way it is, brother. Wait till it's patched. All right, guys. Thank you as always. Take care.